everyone, welcome to another video. Today we are going to show you a new render engine, iCat VR. And thank you the sponsor of this video, iCat VR software. I hope you enjoyed the video and I await your comments in the comment section below. Let's start! Okay, this is the iKit VR official website. You can find a lot of information here. What is it? How does it work? Virtual reality blog. And you also see the, some example of the software. And also, you can download the 15 days free trial from this button. I have a surprise for you. This is the fifth anniversary of iKit VR. So they give you a 20% discount. When you launch the iKit VR, it appears a menu like this, a very cool image by the way. The software asks you you are the designer or explorer. If you click the designer, you can create a fantastic interactive virtual reality project. If you click the explorer button, you can explore the projects that were sent you to through the link. We are the designer, so we click the design button. In this menu, you can find latest news, upgrades, plugins, and some styles in the sections. Let's click this logo and start the software. Wow, very cool intro, huh? You can start to create a new project with this button or open the existing project with this button. Today, I'm going to show you the demo scene. Let's click the iCat Home 2020 button and open our scene. This is the quick tutorial menu, how to navigate in the software and how to import, how to make realistic materials and where to make realistic materials, furnished spaces and objects library also and how to make an interactions the environment settings with pressing the mouse button right click you can turn the camera and you can look around and if you click this icon you can see the main menu new open project save save as and you can import your models from here you know what i get we are a huge object library and if you want to add an object from the library click the objects button and click the objects library and you can choose whatever you want let's add a chair from the vintage pack chairs you know what there are tons of amazing chairs let's choose a special one maybe this when you click this button we need to download yeah that's it and click and drag and drop you can add to the scene the object Let's delete these ones. In object library, there are a lot of amazing models and I'm sure you will love it. Okay, let's continue with another thing. Let's change the environment. Environment panel is also very detailed. As you can see, you can change the hours, you can change the day, you can change the coordinates of the location. You can change the, the sun direction, the cloudiness, the weather. And from this button, you can import your HDRI and you can open the HDRI. As you can see, it's changed. Let's open Grand Canyon, Kiara Morning, Lightwood Fields. As you can see, the lighting is changing. Let's open the City Sky on again. Okay, let's look around here with the WACD case. This is the ray tracing method and I need to say the ray tracing is only available for Windows that it is currently being improved. You can see the lighting much better. If you have a more powerful graphic card, you will see better quality. Let's change the north. Okay, now let's change a material of the one object, maybe maybe this one. Let's click the chair and click the material button. Let's create a new material and standard new material appears here. When we assign to chair, it appears like this. Now let's change the color of 
to the pores, we need to click new material, choose a deep blue color, maybe red, and change the lucidity here. This is the reflection, and this is the metallic, and the emission also. Let's change the walls material. We pick a material from the material library. Let's open the material library from here and click bricks and click again. We need to download first and it appears here and that's it. As you can see <laughs> everywhere is brick now. Let's control Z. Let's create a render from the camera and this button for the render. If you click to this button there are tons of different settings with this we can change the field of view and there are tons of effects here let's choose now no filter from this we can render HD, Full HD, 2K and Ultra HD let's choose Ultra HD this is the 4K and if we click this button we are going to render it. It's rendering now. It depends on your computer spec. Okay, it's rendered. If you click to render folder and our render is here, it's 4K. If you make an animation render, you need to click this button. There are so many settings here. Let's play once. You can make your camera keyframes. Okay, now I'm going to show you a very cool thing. If you click this button, this is the exploration method. You need to change visualization options. Realistic shadow with realistic is okay. And monitor normal speed. Let's start. Exploration loading. We can move around with WACD button like uh, such as a play a game. If you move the door, it opens and we can go to the bathroom and if the door is closing let's try another room let's go to the bathroom as you can see we can move around Let's click this, we can move the chair or rotate, let's click this and also we can change the material of the floor, this is also a really cool thing, let's this one. Let's go to the terrace. Okay, let me show you another cool thing. Let's click the new project. We need to choose a template from here. This is the interior, this is the exterior template, master plan template, 3D configurator and photogrammetry. And let's choose the exterior template and choose flat terrain and start. Okay, this is our landscape or exterior template. When you click the landscape button, it appears this menu. Terrain, trees, plants, rocks, paint, water, world map. Let's add some trees. We need to choose some trees first. As you can see, it's really easy to paint the trees.
Finally, I'm going to show you the vehicles and people from the object library. For this one, click new project again and choose a master plan template and click start. Let's click the animations button here and add some vehicle. American SUV or British hatchback or British luxury or German coupe. There are tons of vehicles here and the quality is really good. Let's look at inside. And outside, you can animate the vehicles and let's add a people also. And I really like these specifications. If you put a people here, let's rotate this one. You can change the animation of the people. For example, this one is idle animation. If you choose texting, it is texting. If you choose the holding box, lying, dancing. Yeah, it's really cool. Sitting and talking and also phone talking. Let's add a woman, maybe dancing and dancing two together. Okay, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. This is the quick interview video with iCat We Are So Fair. I hope if you like the video, I can make more and more videos with iCat We Are So Fair. What do you think guys? Please tell me your thoughts on the comment section below. Do you want me to create some deeper tutorial or making your videos with this software? Please, I wait your comments. Thank you for watching the video and please don't forget to give a like and subscribe for more. See you on the next video.